Hey guys, this is Anthony Morganti. I am MrPhotographer.com. Well, it's the beginning of a new month. I have a new set of Lightroom presets, Lightroom profiles, and LUT files for sale. Last month was a tremendous success. Thank you, everyone that donated. Now, last month's presets, profiles, and LUT files are no longer available. This month's presets, profiles, and LUT files will be available from today to the last day of the month. After that, they too will be gone forever. This month's presets, profiles, and LUT files have a, kind of a cool theme to them. I decided to create something that sides more towards the blues. Next month, I'll do a warm theme. I'm going to be keeping the same pricing structure uh, for these presets, profiles, and LUTs. That is uh, donation only, a minimum donation for each presets, profiles, and LUTs of $2, a recommended donation of $10. When you put any of them in your shopping cart, you could just change the price in the shopping cart from $2 all the way up to as much as you can afford and I really do appreciate all your donations. Now, very quickly, I'm going to demonstrate how to load the presets and profiles into Lightroom. They're all different. Now, I didn't use any presets to create profiles or LUT files to create profiles or anything like that. They're all created independently of one another. If any two happen to look similar, it's purely by accident. Now, we're going to bring the presets into Lightroom first. You can see I have Lightroom open. I'm in the develop module. I downloaded uh, the zip files and they're on my desktop. They're right here. Here's the profiles and here's the presets. There's no need to unzip them. You could leave them zipped up and they'll work in Lightroom version 7.3 on up. So make sure you have the correct version of Lightroom. So the current version all the way back to Lightroom 7.3. Now, let's do the presets first. We're in the develop module on the left-hand side where it says presets. You'll see there's a little plus sign there. We'll click on that and we're going to import presets. And when you do that, a dialog box will come up and you could navigate to where they are on your computer. I mentioned I have them on the desktop, so they're right there. Now, if you downloaded the presets and profiles, you actually could bring them both in at the same time. Uh, just be, it doesn't matter that you clicked on the preset plus sign over here. You actually could bring them right now at the same time, but I'm going to show you independently. So we have the presets. We're going to click import and they're imported already. And they're over here on the left-hand side. They're in this little group uh, with the last two months, October and November, and there's December. And I'll, I'll quickly hover over each one so you can get an idea what they look like. Now I mentioned these have a cool theme. So there's a uh, number one, number two and i didn't give them fancy names so i just you know i thought if i'm doing this month after month i'm going to have a hard time thinking up unique names just not that creative there's number three number four number five there's five there's six there's seven seven's kind of an ethereal look and so is eight and then we go back to kind of a more normal look with nine and 10. So there are the presets. Now we're going to install or import in the profiles. To do that, we're in Lightroom's develop module. We'll go to the basic tab and we'll click on these four bricks right here to go into the profile browser. To the left of that, you'll see the plus sign. Click there, import profiles. Again, they're on my desktop. They're right there and we'll click import. And then once you import them, they'll be grouped with the last two months right here. Now profiles, unlike presets, uh, they're not going to finish your image. You should do the profile very early in your processing. Like the first thing you do is pick the profile because then you'll process off the profile. So the presets will get your, your, should get your image almost done, if not done. The profile gets you started. So we're in December uh, 2019, and I'll hover over each of these as well. So uh, there's number one, number two, number three, number four, number five, number six, number seven, number eight, number nine, and number 10. All right, so those are the Lightroom presets and the Lightroom profiles. Now I also have a set of LUT files. There's 10 LUT files. 
The LUT files don't work in Lightroom, but you would use the LUT files in any application that utilizes a LUT file. That includes Photoshop, Affinity Photo, On One Photo Raw, Luminar, Exposure X5. I mean, anything that uses a LUT file, even video applications like Adobe Premiere Pro and such that use LUTs. All uh, those LUT files will work. They're 3D, 3D LUTs.cube. Again, all of those have a cool theme. So you'll get, you know, kind of the cool look. And as I mentioned, in January of 2020, my set of pre, uh, presets, profiles, and LUTs will have a warm kind of theme to them. So that's it for this month. Again, they're donation only. Uh, recommended donation of $10 each. Minimum donation of $2 each. When you put one in your shopping cart, just change the price from anywhere from $2 to as much as you can afford. And again, I really do appreciate everyone's donations. It really does help me uh, get the things I need to create videos for you. Uh, so I really do appreciate your kind support. Thank you, everyone who watches my videos. I really do appreciate it. I'll talk to you guys soon. <laughs>